Hey guys, welcome back to today's episode. Today's episode is going to be a little different. I've been seeing a lot of thrift uh, videos and like thrift flips, so I wanted to give it a try. I don't know what I'm looking for. One thing I do know is that I wish I could find brass candlestick holders. Will I find them? I don't know. I'm just going to try one of the top rated thrift stores here in Fresno. I've tried one or two before and they didn't have anything good at least not that i could have used so we're gonna give this one a try They definitely have a lot of clothes. Not so much home decor. A little bit of like vintage, I guess, but not so much. So for the first flip, I thought that I would use this vessel to create a vintage pottery looking vessel. Um, I really love the shape and I thought that it would be perfect for that. So since the vessel is pink, I decided to paint it, um, to spray paint it matte white just to cover up the pink in case the grout mortar wouldn't cover. And just so that I wouldn't have to be, you know, like extremely careful about the pink showing through so i am going to use like i said the grout mortar and i decided to uh, add a little bit of dirt to it because i thought that it would add color i don't know if that made any difference so i mean there was no harm in trying it out anyways so when you're making the mortar you basically just add water as you go you don't want it to be too runny because you don't want it you don't want it to like run off of the vase so i'm pretty much uh, creating a really thick consistency just so that it will be easier for me to work with and like grab with my hands as I'm rubbing it onto the vessel and I'm actually rubbing in one direction just because if you rub it back and forth you're going to remove it so I just basically turn the vessel around and you know um, rub the grout onto it as I'm going and just I guess trying to be careful of not letting the pink show through like I said I did spray paint it white so that helped me out a lot I think As you can see, the grout is extremely bright white and I honestly really loved it like this and I was about to leave it this way, but I also really liked the whole vintage look, which is why I decided to try the dirt method, which I've seen a lot of people do. And we basically just rub dirt on it or around it, just gently, not too much. I didn't want it to be extremely dark uh which is why i rubbed very lightly i think i went a little heavy in one on one side of the vessel but what i ended up doing was going back to the same grout mixture that i had and rubbing it a little bit over it so that it would like spread it because i think that it was like a big brown patch <laughs> but you basically just rub dirt as much as you want or as less as you want it's completely up to you Once you're happy with the way that it looks, you have to spray a clear coat onto it just so that the dirt actually stays on the vessel and doesn't rub off.
And here she is. I cannot believe how beautiful this came out. I really was a little intimidated by the project because of the whole vintage look. But I honestly really do love it. And I think it's one of my favorite DIYs I've ever done. Um, it really inspired me to actually want to make more. <laughs> For the next flip, I found this rattan vase, or I don't really know what it was. It looks like a vase to me, and I thought that it would be such a cute project because um, rattan is really popular right now, and my choice was to spray paint it black. I thought about doing it white, but honestly, I have a lot of white going on, and I really like to use black pieces um, as statement pieces throughout my living room or my house in general, so I decided to just go with the black. And here she is. I am so happy with the way that this one turned out as well. I love the black. I think that it was such a good decision of going the black route. I thought about spray painting it white, but like I mentioned before, I think that I have so much white going on already and it just needed a little bit of fresh paint. <laughs> today's episode thank you guys so much for watching i am very happy with the way that my first thrift flip went um i was a little nervous about it because i didn't know what i would expect and like really what i was looking for <laughs> so i think that it was a huge success and if you guys enjoyed this video please make sure to hit the like button just so that i know what you like to watch don't forget to follow me on instagram uh for more behind the scenes and of course a little bit more detail on my videos and everything else my personal life a little bit of my personal life and uh don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already i really appreciate it so so much and yeah i'll see you guys next time bye what it's so cute you like what i did there yeah it's called giraffe oh you're a giraffe look i'm eating the flower <laughs>